Welcome back guys. Just had a phone call for another scrap car and he's picking up a Vauxhall Astra petrol automatic. So I'm gonna go and get that now. It's in Burnley. I bid 150 at this so I should hopefully leave a bit of profit in for us with today's prices. Like I say today's price is roughly about 145 a ton. A Vauxhall Astra will probably weigh 1.2 maybe 1.3 ton so plus the weight of the car and the, sh and the battery and the, and the cart and all that carry on leave a tasty wage in it for me and my brother fell down it's been quite a busy week on the Vauxhall this week that's saying something in it don't buy a Vauxhall <laughs> so everyone has their favourite cars and stuff like that but we're Ford men really, I know we've got a Sprinter to pick up, but we're, we're Ford men. Um, shut the door. My brother Luke, he's not with me now, but my brother, he's got a Mark II Escort. He's currently on with restoring that. He's uh, taking that over to Blackburn soon to be uh, start work on some bodywork, so that, that'll be a vlog. So keep an eye out for that. And my other brother, Billy. He just sold a Mark 1 Escort and he's, got an, he's actually got another one with um, a 2 litre Pinto engine in it which is ready to go out in the summer but I'm a Ford Transit man myself I'd, I'd rather go like my Ford Transit camper van Can't beat it So, yeah, I'll be back in touch with you in a minute when I get to this job and uh, we'll, we'll get it loaded on and get it strapped down and get back home ready for some tea. I'll see you shortly guys. This Astra, um, the chap said it's got an electrical fault. So it might be something or nothing. If the body works alright on it we'll have a look. If it's any good and we can get it fixed easy enough we might be another one to sell on but if it's no good it wouldn't send we'll be getting the battery and cat chopped off. Uh, sometimes when we have sold things on the past up to, on eBay you get a lot of messages that most people probably know that saying that they're going to turn up and they never turn up and stuff like that so you, and plus eBay and PayPal fees at the minute ridiculous it takes all your profit away so we tend really to have to sell them into trade to lads or just weigh them in so there's no there's no way to kill comebacks you know so we've also ordered it got it here we ordered it last a couple of months ago actually off ebay it's a stamp with his business name on it so instead of writing out with a pen on the logbook when we're filling the logbook out we have a, uh, a stamp which we just stamp it which is easy and sign it and then uh, have to do it online now which is straight away or just send off in the post and if the buyer uh, sorry the customer wants the logbook give us a logbook to fill out we can have like say we fill it out take it to the scrapyard and get them an uh, issue them a COD certificate which is a certificate of destruction so to say that that car's off the road and never be back on the road again so it gives the buyer and the seller both a peace of mind no history coming back off that I'm just trying to get used to these doing these vlogs I keep stuttering and stuff but I'll get used to it I think and I keep saying erm, um, I do know that erm, um, this and erm, um, that but be right as long as you guys like watching them I'll keep putting them on everyone round here is on the cars up innit as soon as the price goes up everyone comes out of the woodwork starts buying vans and pickups and all sorts and starts trying to uh, get on the scrap game you can't blame him really, there's not much work about the minute with Covid and all that carry on so we've still got mouths to feed and bills to pay so fair play to the guys and girls at least it's not bloody really cold this morning and today spring is in the air Is there any subscribers on here from Burnley or local to Lancashire or anything? 
let me know in the comments if you are right I'm just around the corner from this uh, this car now so I'll ask the customer if they want to be filmed if not you'll see it when it's on back at the truck and when I'm on my way back home I'll see you soon nearly here now nearly here now does anyone want to guess what colour this Astra is I haven't seen it before I'm going to go for silver silver or blue in 270 yards, turn left onto Crowwood Avenue. I hope it's got original bloody cat on it. I've had a bad few, bad few uh, cars and nobody cats on it, really. Left here now, Crowwood Avenue. to get these clocks fixed so they don't know how much bloody diesel they've got in it. So we need in it a recovery truck breaking down. The right laughing stock if I have. Turn right onto Wesley Grove. Then arrive Should be your round here somewhere. Silver or blue I'm going for it. Might be a blue one. Is it this estate one here? I think on your left. There it is. Right, I'll get it loaded up and I'll be back soon. Right, let's get it loaded up.
as easy as that folks a couple of minutes i'll just get the straps on now ramps away it's actually quite a clean car it sounds like the starter motor sticking on it but i'll inspect that more when i get back it's a 57 plate petrol done under 25,000 miles so plastic wheels look like alloys but 1.8 petrol hmm might make one so right then that ends today's vlog or well, this afternoon's vlog i've already put one on but i thought i'd get you uh, get you involved with this one as well so don't forget to like and comment subscribe any questions or anything like that all you need to do is ask and i'll try my best to answer them thank you very much and i'll see you tomorrow